we're going to be making pinwheels. So this week we're going to relax a little bit. We're going to relax because that's what the readings remind us to do. Here. What we're going to need today, we're going to need a yellow card stock with template, pink card stock with template, green pencil for the stem. Careful, one push pin from weeks two and three, some glue, and from home, scissors. We're gonna take our time with this craft and we're gonna go slow. And fast. And fast, but first slow. And we're gonna be very careful to cut on the lines. Now let's get candying. Let's get candying. What, candying? <laughs> You don't have to worry about making any mistakes or doing anything wrong. Just stay on the line. In fact, not worrying is what the gospel reading is about today. Jesus says no one can serve two masters. He will either hate one and love the other or be devoted to one and despise the other. We got to stay true to God. Can't serve ourselves and God. We can't serve the paper. And God and ourselves. Mm -hmm. We gotta just serve God. We have we have to have one master, God. And we're gonna go slow and steady on this because the readings today, they remind us that the birds in the sky, they don't sow or reap. They don't plant seeds and they don't have farms. They don't collect their food and build barns to store their food. But God takes care of the birds, right? Mm-hmm. Is there always plenty of food for the birds? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Do you think if God loves the birds so much to provide for them, that he'll love us and provide for us? Mm-hmm. Because if he only loved the animals, we wouldn't be here anyway. That's right. God's eternal love creates us every minute and every second of our existence. He liked us. He would like us. He, and he does like us. He loves us. He loves us into existence every moment of our existence. If he loves us that much to continue our existence all the time, this is really good, sweetie. Um, do you think he's going to provide for us? Mm hmm. What's your circle for? You'll see. Now we're going to put a little bit of glue in the center like this. And we're gonna put the other pinwheel on top so it's alternating like this. This is a little bit tricky. You ready? So, now while we're waiting on this to dry just a little bit, I wanna to talk to you a little bit more about not worrying. So, Don't what are some worry, of the things. God is here. That's right. Even if monsters, nightmares. That's scare right, because God is bigger than the monsters. Yeah. Push. Mm. Alright, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna. Fold these over loosely. No, we're not going to make a crease. We're just going to fold it over loosely and then turn it and then do the next one. Put a little dollop of glue. Put the, the other circle on. Alrighty. Alright. Let me do. Alright, cool. See? Now we got the center glued on there. So when you see a pinwheel, what do you think of? Jesus. Wow. When I see a pinwheel, I think of people running and playing and having fun and relaxing. And so our pin, when we see our pinwheel, what we want to do is we want to remember that we shouldn't worry or get stressed about things in life because God's in charge. God's in control. God's bigger than all of our worries. God is bigger than all of our problems and all of our fears. Even monstrous nightmares and night God is furies. so much bigger than monstrous nightmares and night furies. Mm -hmm. God already died on the cross for us. And that's it. He made the sacrifice. So we don't have Ow! to worry. We don't have to stress. Because God's going to take care of us. You're going to use your push pin and push it through the hole. The hole there. So go ahead and take your flower. Why it in and then push that. Blow. Good job. 
Great job! Hey, how about we take our pinwheels and we go outside and play with them and we relax and we enjoy the rest of our Sunday? Mm-hmm. You can get all these guys at themathbox.com. Thank you.